Hello there, welcome back to Neetha's Indulgences. You know those days when you just want something quick, tasty and a little different? And that's what we are making today. It's got a mix of flavours, savoury, a touch of sweetness and a bit of spice. So what are we waiting for? Let's crack on with it. Quick, flavorful and perfect for using leftover rice. Filipino fried rice is the classic. Let's start the cooking of our Filipino fried rice. I'm going to add some olive oil. Let's add lots of minced garlic. We're going to fry the minced garlic until it turns light golden in color. Make sure not to burn them. Now this is the color that we are looking at. See it's turned light golden in color. Now we'll transfer the fried garlic to another plate and set it aside. In the same oil we are going to add some spring onions. We need a lot of spring onions because spring onions gives a very nice earthy flavour to this dish. Okay, this is yesterday's leftover rice. It's approximately one cup. The aroma is just amazing because you know the we fried that garlic in that oil. A teaspoon or one and a half teaspoon of white pepper. Make sure to use only white pepper. Add one and a half tablespoon of soy sauce. I like a little bit of heat so I'm adding in um, like half a teaspoon of red chilli flakes. Not much. And give this a good mix. Always check for your seasoning. If you want more of white pepper and salt, please adjust it accordingly. Now for the final touch, let's add the crispy golden in colour garlic. Garnish with lots of spring onions because this gives a very good flavour. All this up really nicely. Now this is Filipino fried rice for you all. Our second dish is spicy honey prawns. Juicy prawns with a perfect balance of heat and sweetness. Simply addictive. Heat a pan, add sesame oil or you can use olive oil as well but I would prefer sesame oil because that gives a good flavour. So just a teaspoon, not much. Add two teaspoons of ginger. Let's saute this until the ginger is cooked because my cameraman doesn't like to bite into the ginger. Time to add 2 tablespoons of honey, add 1.5 tablespoon of dark soy sauce. Now adjust the honey as per your liking. If you like a little more sweeter, you can add in more honey and if, or if you like a little bit of spice then add in a little more of chilli flakes. Add your prawns, this is roughly about 250 grams. Let's toss in all the sauces. Your prawns have started curling up, so you're almost there. I'm going to add in some red chilli flakes. Please add as per your liking. We like it a little bit spicy, so I'm adding in roughly about one and a half teaspoon. So this is what I was telling you about. The balance of heat and sweetness. Add some spring onions.
Thanks for joining me in making this Filipino fried rice and spicy honey prawns. Okay, I'm going to try the Filipino fried rice. Along with the spicy honey prawns. It is very really nice. The combination is just ultimate. Bye bye. These dishes are easy, delicious, and ready to impress. If you like this video, then do give this a thumbs up. Until next time, take care. Bye bye. Wow, that's something you like. Hello. Action. Ah. Action. And that's what we are making today. It's got a mix of flavors. Uh, thank you.